Good day everyone. You are welcome to this tutorial. My name is Peter Emanje at Davirugu. At GJGIS Solutions, we offer services in installation, training, data acquisition, data integration, and data analysis. Today, I want to show you how to buffer features in QGIS. How to buffer features in QGIS. Please remember to subscribe to my channel. And first and foremost, when you talk of buffer or buffering in GIS, uh, in GIS, a buffer is a zone that is drawn around any point, line, or polygon that encompasses all of the feature within a specified uh, distance of the feature. And buffer are used often because many spatial analysis are concerned with distance constraints. For example, uh, let's say an uh, emergency planner who wants to know which school are within 1.5 kilometers of a fort. So these are the reason why buffering uh, is very important in GIS analysis. Let's go to QGIS. Now I have my data already in my QGIS. I have the bookshops. I have schools, uh, which is within Giwa local government area of Kaduna states. Now what you want to do is that I want to create a specified zone around the school and now examine how many of these bookshops fall within the specified zones. For uh, in this example, we want to use like uh, let's say three kilometer. We buffer three kilometer around the school, the school which is in blue, and we now see how many bookshops that is this one in black that falls within that kilometer or that zones. That's exactly what we want to do. And first thing to note before you do that, uh, right click go to properties and go to uh, source you will realize that the reference system that is the coordinate reference system is very important all the data you want to use must be in the same coordinate reference system so i note that that is in wgs84 uh, <clears throat> it's very important to note that now to buffer what you do is that you go to vector and you go to geoprocessing to go to buffer now, what you want to buffer, I want to buffer schools at specified kilometer. In this case, we put schools and see how many bookshops fall within that zone. Now, one thing you must notice that our data is in decimal degree. So you have to take note of that. Now, I want to show you something here. Remember to subscribe to my channel. Now, one degree is equal to 111 kilometer in this example we want to use three kilometer so converting three kilometer to decimal degree is give us 0 0.027 degree so please uh remember this because we need it so now we now come back here we have selected school that you want to buffer then how many di di distance in degree do you want to do you want to buffer in this case, we want to buffer 3 kilometer, which is equivalent to 0 0.027. Now, we have written that. Then the segments, maybe let's like just increase this to 10. Then, the dissolve result. After the result, we should want to dissolve it so that it will not show the outline of the result. So, you check that. Then, click here and save it in a folder so in this exercise i want to save it in tutorial folder on my desktop so let's just call this one a uh, buffer so buffer and click save or let's just say three kilometer buffer three kilometer underscore buffer so and click save then you click on run so it has run and you close now the school it has run this is three kilometer buffer around the school and it has run now if you look at this you see that you can bring it down here to see it very well so the blue one is the schools while the black one is the bookshops now if you look at it at three kilometer radius around the school you can see the black one are the bookshops that are within that specified distance or zones so like this one now it has two bookshops closer to it that is within three kilometers specified 
so you can see now this is how to buffer in QGIS once again remember to subscribe to my channel thank you for watching this video